Well, everybody, it's that time again. Spring's rolling around. Hopefully the gobblers are starting to get fired up. Um, got about another month here in Georgia before it gets, uh, gets going good. So I uh, actually got a few emails coming in on my hank. Uh, people want to try to get, get it down uh, before spring comes around. Um, this is the new, uh, the new polycarb paint. I got it in the mail the other day. Um, they both sound real similar. Uh, the walnut, the polycarb, like I said, they're real similar sound. They both, in my opinion, are, you know, sound just as good either or. Um, they do have a slightly different tone. That's the only thing, uh, that I've found that they have. So, um, still got some people wanting to know, you know, how to get it down, how to get your tongue right. Um, basically what I could tell you to do is to take it in steps. Uh, you know, I have some guys that I've talked to, they try to blow it, they try to get it down, but just take it in steps. Just want to blow, I mean, it, it does take a pretty good amount of air. It, it, it's not, it's not crazy amounts, but you just blow it like a balloon. Like I've said, just blow it, blow it like you're blowing a balloon up. I would personally get this part down and then move to the next step. So. I'm going to try the polycarb. So blow it like you're blowing up a balloon. And it, it get this tone before you go any further. So try to get this tone before you move on. Just get that down. If you can get that tone down, that's the only, that's the, that's all the air that you need to blow in it just to get that tone. Um, another thing, um, is the way you hold it. Um, for example, you can see here that I hold it just basically like a duck call. Um, but you, the way I get the good tone out of it is to have a, a bigger sound chamber. So I see some people that I've met here locally, they they hold it real tight, but you know, it uh, sounds better if you have the open sound chamber. So you're gonna wanna make your hands like almost like a cup, like you're, like I've said, you're trying to hold a bug in there, you're trying not to kill it, um, but you don't want it to get out. Um, but once you've got the tone down, which is just a steady stream of air, free air, a lot of times you hear them say the free air is not like you're about to, you know, blow in your sunglasses to wipe them off. You want to fog the sunglasses up. That, that's not the air you're wanting. Just the free air. <laughs> And then add your tongue into it. And it just, like, the slower the better it sounds to me. Like, the slower I get my tongue, the better it is. But again, to get that, just kind of put your tongue up to your teeth, blow. It sounds fast there but the back pressure of the call will help slow it down when you blow it. So <clears throat> again, just get one part down at a time. The air, <laughs> then the tongue, just practice on that for a week, five days, whatever, three days. <laughs> and then your hands come into it. That's the part to me that makes the call. Um, you just, you don't do anything special with your hands. You can shake it a little bit to, to get the more realistic sound, but you don't have to do anything really special. Just close them together. So, Don't try to move too fast, one step at a time. Um, that's how I basically did it. You, you, I started, figured out what kind of tone it needed to sound like, put my tongue into it, and then my hands. Uh, don't rush into it, just take it slow, just like a mouth call. You know, it took me, took me time to learn on a mouth call, take you a little bit of time to learn on this, but it's not hard once you, once you get it down. But <clears throat> just I'll do it one more time. The airflow. tongue then the hands but 
But as you can tell, that's the polycarb. It's, it's an awesome car. Um, but as you heard the polycarb, I'm going to blow the walnut now. Did you hear the little bit of difference in tone, but it's really the same sound. So. Just keep practicing, you'll get it. Like I said, air, <laughs> tongue, <laughs> hands. <laughs> but keep the questions coming. Let me know if I can help out in any way. Um, some of the guys that have already emailed me, sorry I hadn't got back to you, but I will send this link over to you. And uh, the Hank by Down and Dirty, go get you one.